If you've got headache which doesn't respond to pain medications or is persistent, then you may have underlying muscle tension and joint stiffness. And that's the type of headache that can respond well to physiotherapy. But I'm going to show you a few techniques to do which you can help yourself with. So uh, first you need to identify whether this is the type of headache that you have, a tension type headache. And it tends to occur on one side. It happens in the area at the base of the skull. It can come around the side or over the top of the head and also be present around the eye, back of the eye area. You would often tend to find that you've got muscle tension in the neck and shoulder area. You can wake with it first thing in the morning if you've slept awkwardly, like if you've been using one over one pillow, putting your head in an awkward flexed position. Or it can come on across the course of the day if you've maintained a static posture, whether it's sitting or standing. You need to differentiate between this tension type headache, which is dull and throbbing, and a migraine, which is of greater intensity and can cause nausea and visual disturbances. So why does the neck, muscle and joints cause headache? Well, it's simply a pain referral pattern. Tension occurs in the muscle, it builds to a sufficient level to cause joint stiffness. And once the joint is irritated enough, then we will start to feel pain in that area described and that is because that area is served by the same nerve which is serving the affected spinal joint which is up at the upper neck base of the skull. So watch now as I show you some techniques which you can do to help you sleep more comfortably or get through your working day easier. The first technique is spinal realignment. So I'm going to draw the chin back and align the neck better. Now ideally you would hold that as long as you could, maybe one minute. Sometimes it's useful to use a to stand against a wall with your back against the wall and you'll feel your head touching the wall. That's good feedback to know that your head is in a good position. Uh, if you fatigue in under a minute, then just keep it short. Hold for 10 seconds and then relax and then repeat three times. Now I want to exert an upward pull on these muscles. So I'm going to put a hand here as an anchor point and place my fingers underneath the base of the skull and pull upwards. My head is flexing slightly. Hold that position for 10 seconds. So here's a side on view of the stretch which I've just performed. Pulling upward, hold for 10 seconds and repeat three. So the next stretch is for the left side of the neck, assuming that there's a left side headache. So I'll place my hand here and my right hand over the side of the head and face and these are to allow me to focus on these muscles which span the gap in between so I'll just pull over to the right I'll feel a stretch there which I'll hold for 10 seconds and then return to the middle and repeat three of those and then the next one is more of an oblique stretch so we're finding the muscles in between the exact center of the neck and the side so the head turns approximately 45 degrees and once again the hands are in a similar position and now I lift like I did in the first one and pull downwards in the direction of my elbow and hold again for 10 seconds and repeat three. And you can repeat this cycle starting at the first one and just going through them until you find that it's easier. You can also massage around the base of the skull going out to this bony point behind the ear that's often a good spot. When you're doing that self-massage around the base of the skull or behind the ear, you might find uh, one or two particular points where it's exceptionally tender or it reproduces the headache. It might relieve it either way. If you find that spot, just stick with it and stay on it for a few seconds. And you just need to rub around like this and provide some even pressure. Or better still, get someone else to do it for you. Lie on your back and just get them to massage through the neck and the base of the skull. So thank you for watching. I hope you found that video useful and I hope it enables you to get on with your life and have more fun and not be held back by your headache.